Hey everybody, this is David with Android Police, and as you can see, we've got a Note 5 here. And uh, this video uh, is about something of a design flaw we've discovered with, uh, I shouldn't say we've discovered. I read about this and I thought, you know what, I bet it's not as bad as it all sounds like it is. Uh, and it's a flaw with the S Pen slot on the Note 5 here. So as you know with the S Pen, you've got this nifty new click out mechanism for the S Pen. And so you pull out the pen as you no normally would. But you'll notice on our review unit here, it didn't make a sound when the pen came out. It should make a sound because sounds are enabled as is vibration. It didn't make a sound or vibrate. Uh, that's because the phone no longer knows when the S Pen is or is not in the device. Uh, breaking this was extremely easy. So easy, in fact, that I would say this constitutes a design defect with the phone. So let me show you how it works. And I've tried to fix it now uh, by essentially replicating my steps, which aren't exactly many, and no, it's, it's still broken. So if you put in the S Pen the right way, as you can see, it slides right in there, as you would expect it to, and then you just click your little button, and the pen goes in. What if we did it backward? And I'm not saying this is something everybody's going to do, but it is going to happen. Uh, either a child is going to do this, or somebody just not paying attention is accidentally going to put in their S Pen backward. And let's just slide that in. Oh wait, it's just as easy to slide in as you would in the right direction. Isn't that something? And uh, so let's click it in like we would, and then we realize, oh no, the S Pen is now stuck. Uh, because it's in the wrong way. Uh, and I will be able to get it out here in a moment, uh, but basically, when you do get it out eventually, uh, you will notice, sorry, the pen is a bit greasy now because it has been through this trial a couple of times, uh, and I may not be able to get it out for the purpose of this video, but essentially once this happens, the S Pen detection mechanism breaks. Uh, now, it may not completely break, depending on your level of success or failure, uh, whatever you want to call it, but on this one, this Note 5 right here, which is brand new and we got from Samsung, it is totally broken. And the pen, obviously, is not exactly super easy to get out uh, once it's in there uh, the wrong way. And it's super easy to get in there, though. It goes in with basically no resistance at all, which is a bit disturbing uh, because this, this is going to happen to somebody. And uh, they're going to get stuck and they're going to break the detection mechanism. And guess who they're going to ask for a free repair or replacement? It's going to be Samsung. We're not sure how this got past testing inside Samsung because it seems really obvious given that all of the previous notes, you would not be able to put that S Pen in there super easily uh, the wrong way. You'd have to really force it. And I'm just going to pick up a note that I have over here, a Galaxy Note Edge, and I'm going to show you real quick uh, how the old S Pen mechanism works. Uh, as you can see, you've got a Note Edge here. Here's the S Pen. We're going to try to put it in backward. It doesn't even go. Uh, I mean, you could probably force it if you really wanted, but you would immediately know it was going in the wrong way. On the Galaxy Note 5, there's no way to tell. So let me see if I can get it out here now. Uh, yeah, it's not looking like it. I'm going to have to sit down at my desk and wriggle it free again. Uh, it does come out, but once you've gotten it out of there, uh, it usually just seems to completely break the pen detection mechanism. I've tried reboots and everything and toggling the sounds off and on, detection off and on, nothing works. It did sporadically detect that it was detached once or twice, but now it doesn't do anything at all. So yeah, uh, that seems like a fairly uh, significant design flaw on Samsung's part there, and we will be reaching out to them to ask about it. 